This video will help you better understand how to import your AnyTune files into your AnyTune app on your iOS device. Now that can be your iPhone, your iPad, your iPad mini, and AnyTune also makes an application for the Mac desktop. But please keep in mind that for the iOS devices, you'll need to do this through the app itself. So first of all, download the app, and once you do, you'll pretty much be where we are right now on this screen. And I'm using my iPhone, so things are a little bit more compact, but I'll, I'll kind of run through these, and if I remember some of the other points, like on an iPad, that can better help you navigate to where we want to go, I'll certainly help. So bottom left-hand corner, you'll find Tune. So go ahead and hit that. The green plus sign, you'll want to touch that. Next, find Download in the middle of the page. This will take you to the Partners page. Go ahead and hit Partners. And at the bottom, you'll find Beat Creature Lessons. So go ahead and click that. And the next thing you'll do, you'll be brought to the website, beatcreature.com. And you'll notice that in this example, you, we're using the song Jump by Van Halen. So the song title is listed there. Underneath of that is the song artist album, which again, you have to use the exact song that we put the files originally over top of so they match. So you'll have an opportunity there to download this song directly from iTunes. Below that, you'll find the AnyTune marker file. So we're gonna go ahead and touch that. And it will say, it'll ask you if you wanna download it, hit yes. So now it'll say that the import results worked and so now we're gonna hit OK, hit done. It brings us back to the application. The next thing we'll do, bottom right hand corner, you'll find a little blue outline of a cloud. Go ahead and touch that. And now you'll find jump any tune file, pretty much second from the top. Go ahead and touch that. And now that basically selects the file, hit jump and now restore the top right hand corner there so everything is all set hit OK and hit uh, hit tunes to go back and now what you'll do is find the song and I've already made this uh, so the loop and marker files are already set up but in case you're not there uh, what I just touched there bottom right hand corner you see the little flag there and this will expand all the other options that we have so if you want to go back to the audio file where you see the transients far left hand corner you see the little transients there go ahead and hit that and it brings us back to this